All right, praise the Lord, everyone. Um, I decided to do this since I have the day off and I have the time to do it. I decided to, this what I want to do. See this cross here? My brother Sam Jordan made this for me from Pennsylvania. Those who know Sam Jordan, uh, he's from, um, he's from Pennsylvania. <laughs> I forgot what town. But he made this cross for me, and I've been using this cross since uh, I've been using this cross since um, since we've been doing the walk. Um, but I'm just gonna tag only a few people, a few. Uh, Not a lot of people, but I'm gonna share this to a couple of groups I'm in. And so this is the cross here. I'm about to carry this cross through my neighborhood. I'm about to go all the way down there. And I'm about to go, I'm gonna go to my uh, my mechanic who put the wheels on for me. Um, I'm gonna show you the wheels real quick and put the wheels on me. And my mechanic is, is a Christian too. So I went to his couple of his Bible studies and and that's how we um, got along. But his his son put this wheels on me, uh, on, on the cross, so I could carry the cross. So I'm gonna carry the cross all the way down to my neighborhood around the corner. And I'm gonna videotape myself. I got myself a, uh, uh, a vest chest these are good to have just in case you buy yourself if you're street preaching or if you buy yourself these, these are good to have uh, so um so i'm gonna put this my, put my phone in my vest chest whatever you want to call it iphone chest and uh i'm gonna go from there I think I tagged my brother. I think I tagged my brother Sam on this. Oops. This is my first time actually carrying the cross. But just bear with me, and uh, I'll just put this. I'm gonna put this on. best way I can and so there you go I'm gonna walk down this street take a right and I'm take a left and walk down a, a, another long street is a busy street the main street and walk to my mechanic and I called my mechanic and I told him that I would be there I'm gonna show him and uh going to do this in Jesus' name. Uh, here we go. Those that are watching can watch along. I don't know what's the best angle for this, but put it like this. And I'm gonna carry my cross. And I'm gonna carry it all through my neighborhood. Everybody know I'm gonna carry this cross. So I'm over here carrying the cross, and uh, 
This is not not the showboat, but I always, always wanted to carry the cross and to just show everybody who God is. So I'm over here just um, picking up this cross. I'm gonna walk down this long street. I will see how many how many people go engage or react. Uh, it's a quiet neighborhood though. So I live in a quiet neighborhood. But I'm gonna take this cross and bear this cross in the name of Jesus. So I'm gonna switch my camera around. I just wanna ask everybody to walk with me. Please walk with me. Carry this. It's all this time. I'm gonna bear my cross. Walk this cross. No matter what people say, no matter what people say, Knowing that Jesus Christ is coming back. And I just want to show the world who I represent as my Lord and Savior by carrying this cross and um and hopefully I win some souls just by doing this. But um uh, God is good. It's all because of the Holy Spirit is why I'm able to do this, that I want to do it from my heart to let everybody know that Jesus Christ is King. He died on the cross. He died on the old rugged cross. The cross I'm carrying is very light to a God carried, God carried an old rugged cross. So I'm asking everybody here who's looking in, just please walk with me. And um, I thank God for the Holy Ghost because if it wasn't for the Holy Ghost, I would not be carrying the cross all through my neighborhood. Wow, this cross is getting heavy. But I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep going. It's good exercise. I'm exercising my faith. That's right. I'm exercising my faith. I don't know why this thing doesn't want to stand. But hold it together. I'm exercising my faith. I'm exercising my faith. Once again, I live in a very quiet neighborhood. But uh, I'm going to do this in Jesus' name. I'm gonna walk up here and I'm gonna take a left. And uh, 
I need some shoulder pads. <laughs> Cause my shoulders starting to hurt a little bit. But that's okay. Let me keep on striving, keep on pushing. Keep on pressing. In the name of Jesus. Knowing that Jesus is Lord. And Jesus is King. Jesus is the Alpha. He is the Omega. He is the first and the last. He is the beginning. And he is the ending. Which is, which was, and which is to come. I thank God for another day. Bless me to see another day. Bless me to see another day, knowing that this is the day that the Lord had made and I'm going to rejoice and be glad in it. Jesus Christ died for our sins. The Bible says without the shedding of blood, there is no remission of sins. And Jesus Christ Without the shedding of the blood, his precious blood, the Bible says, there'll be no forgiveness of sins. As we carry the cross, see, people could wear a cross on their necks, but how many people could, wear, could bear their cross? How many people can walk their cross? That's why I'm walking with God. And I'm walking by faith, exercising my faith, walking in the true loving of Jesus Christ, knowing that Jesus is the way, the truth, and he is the life. You know, people are scared about this pandemic, have fear of the pandemic, but how many people have the fear of God? How many people fear God? He took the pain and the punishment for each and every one of us that spit upon him, they beat him, they punched him, they mocked him, and he didn't say one mumbling word. If God could do that for me, I know I could at least do, something, do this for him knowing that not only he was put on the cross, my sins was put on the cross. My sins are nailed to the cross. So every, every time I mess up, every time I have fallen, my sins are forgiven because I serve a forgiving God. The Bible say, if we confess our sins, he is faithful just to forgive our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. We live in a world that's full of unrighteousness. When you live in a world that's full of ungodly, we live in an ungodly world. But Jesus Christ didn't come for the righteous, he came for the sinners to repent and turn from their wicked ways. All right, so here's a main street here. I'm gonna go up this main street. Got some cars going by. And carry this cross. Mary didn't carry the cross, so stop worshiping Mary. None of the disciples carried the cross, so don't worship the disciples. Buddha did not carry the cross. Muhammad did not carry the cross. And Jesus, and Jesus only. And Jesus loves you.
and he died for you. Jesus Christ is the only one that can save you from your sins. He died so you can live today. How you doing? Good. Yeah, thank you. God bless you. <laughs> yeah. God is good. He's wonderful. And he's worthy to be praised. That's the God that we serve. We serve our almighty God. All power is in the hands of the Lord. All power is in the hands of the Lord. He got the whole world in his hands. So I just want to let everybody know that God loves you. I love you. The Bible says, love covers the multitude of sins. And Jesus Christ wants to come into your life and put that love in you. Believe me, saints and friends, if it wasn't for the love of God, I will not be doing this. I will not be doing this if because if it, if it was, if it wasn't for the love of God, I will not be doing this. The Bible says this is the day of salvation. Today is the day of salvation. We gotta recognize who God is. Knowing that he is the Messiah, he is the reign supreme, he's a deliverer, he's our refuge, he's our shield, our shelter, he's everything, and we are nothing without him. We need Jesus Christ in our lives. He needs to be the center of our lives today. And I truly, truly believe that It's all because of the love of God. It's all because of the love of God is what I'm doing. Now I'm hitting the main, I'm hitting the main street here. You know, this is really good exercise. I need to do this more often. But uh, hey. You know what? Many people drive by. Many people walk by. I see the young girls. She just say, "I'm, I'm happy with what you're doing. That's that's a blessing." Well, a lot of people walk by. People drive by. I want to see how many horns are gonna knock. How many horns? How many people gonna blow their horn? So far, I got none. No people. <laughs> I got nobody blowing the horn for me. You know, if the devil is bold, we gotta be bold too. We gotta represent Jesus. Jesus Christ. Rachel, God bless you, cause. got to represent Jesus. The Bible say, if I be lifted up, I will draw all men unto me. He say, if I be lifted up, I will draw all men unto me. We need to learn how to lift up the name of Jesus because he's worthy to be praised. He is worthy to be praised. Sad thing about this, I gotta walk back. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta walk back <laughs> with the cross. Well, Jesus Christ has saved my soul, made me whole. Old things have passed away, and everything became new. I'm a new creature in Jesus Christ. 
exercising my faith, putting my faith towards Jesus, knowing that he is the Alpha, he is the Omega, he is the way, the truth, and the life. He is the great I am. He is the great I am. So we must repent. We must turn from our wicked ways and turn to Jesus. We must turn to Jesus Christ. We must turn to Jesus Christ. So those who are watching, my shoulder's getting tired, but I'm turning to Jesus Christ, exercising my faith, putting my faith towards Jesus. Not a lot of people will bear a cross or carry a cross around the neighborhood, but hey, if the devil is bold, we gotta be bold too. If the devil is showing up and popping his head up, that we could pop our head up and represent our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And I thank God for, for the Holy Ghost, because if it wasn't for the Holy Ghost, I would not be doing this. I'll tell you that right now. I know people be like, man, that guy is crazy. But I'm crazy for Jesus. Amen. I am crazy for Jesus. And, um, it's my first time doing this. Thing is, I gotta walk back, so I'm going to my mechanic. My mechanic is a Christian too. And he put the wheels, he put the wheels on this cross for me. And um, I just wanna share my faith. And I just wanna show him, and just, I just wanna thank him for being my mechanic because a lot of mechanics are not Christians but uh I used to go to his Bible studies I used to do these I used to do everything with him but um I'm walking down to his shop and we are going to and I'm going to show him the cross so I'm walking down a main street here Wonder how many, how many, wonder how many, how many, how many, how many people gonna blow their horn? Is anybody gonna blow their horn for Christ? Or is only anybody gonna be looking and staring? I'm blow my horn for Jesus Christ. So um, I'm gonna put my I'm gonna put my phone back up. Hold on, let me turn it around. Amen. It's not all about skin color. It's all about Jesus. It's not all about skin color. It's all about Jesus. I can't believe my phone's dying already, dude. It's not all about skin color, it's all about Jesus. The Bible says he is the way, the truth, and he is the life. No man can get to the Father but through him. 
you have to go through Jesus Christ to make it into the kingdom of God. No fornicators, no idolaters, no whoremongers, no drunkenness. Nothing will separate me from the love of God. Knowing that he is the only way, the only truth, and he is the only life. God is good all the time and all the time God is good God bless you truck. Big old truck. My mom was at my mechanic shop. Down here, carrying the cross. Oh my God, it's good. How you doing, fellas? Good. God bless you guys. God bless you. God bless you, man. Yep, this thing's getting heavy. My phone's dying. I mean, I can't believe my phone is dying. I just walked down the street. Yeah, I need a new phone. I'm almost there, say to friends. And uh, this is definitely good exercise. Definitely a good way of exercising your faith and uh thank the lord Whew, now I'm going downhill which is much easier All right, Saints to friends, so my phone is dying so quick. I gotta get, I need a new phone. But um, I, I'm gonna have to sign off because my phone is dying. 
I'm gonna have to charge it up. And uh, what's up, Leo, my brother? And uh, and um, I thank God for this opportunity to um carry the cross. And uh, God bless you. And I love you in the name of Jesus. Jesus is good. Jesus is awesome. Jesus is king. His name is Jesus. God bless you in Jesus' name. I'll be back on soon, later on. I gotta charge my phone. <laughs>